Asante kwa kutualika. Karibu sana Lofty. That's a very interesting name. Asante. <laughs> He's representing the Lofty Eye. <laughs> Mr. President, you look well and there are people who have been commenting. One of the first questions that we told to ask you is ask the president what's his exercise regimen or is it diet? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I have um, you know, I, I had a, a, an original, uh, uh, you know, fit that ran amok uh, the last uh, one and a half years or two years because uh, we went into elections. And you know, when you have elections, you have a lot of pressure. Sometimes you take out the pressure on food. And uh, you have uh, to do this and that, and you don't have time to go exercise, and sometimes you eat. Uh, because you don't know when you will find the next meal, so sometimes you overeat. So I decided to uh, cut it down because uh, yeah. so you need to be a lot. <laughs> Our first topic for tonight is on the state of the economy, the cost of living, and of course Kenya Kwanzaa's first budget. My colleague Ayub will take the first question. Excellency, Mr. President, I want to take you back to what you said on the 26th of July, 2022, during the presidential debate yes. before the elections. To quote you, you said, we can limit the taxation on fuel. Take, for example, VAT, which you said, I think we need to rethink about it. That was the UDA presidential candidate. President William Ruto, months later, is proposing to Parliament to raise it to 16%. Why the double speak, Mr. President? Thank you very much. 